Hi, a little over a month ago, I released a major update to my energy effect free plugin for DaVinci Resolve Proto. You're seeing a little bit of what it can do here. I like it a whole lot. The reception was amazing, but uh, there was one little issue. Because of the way Proto was built and some of the complicated systems and uh, third-party resources I brought in, I had to have a slightly different installation method. And while that method worked for me, and I believe the overall majority of people, um, it didn't work for everyone. I had a simple drag and drop installer, and for some people, it didn't work. So I finally uh, went back and looked at that, and, and I looked at what I could do. So today, I am releasing an alternate installation method. If the first method works for you, great. If not, try this one. I know for sure it works for some people the first one didn't work for. If this also doesn't work, we'll figure it out from there. Download link in the description. Again, this will be a free download. Uh, but here's what you're going to get. When you download, you will get this Proto V2 alternate zip. You can open that up. And inside, you have this DRFX file and this .lua file. I don't know if there's a reason why the order should matter, but... Uh, just to be safe, I would recommend installing this uh, Lua first, this Proto V2 Alt. So for that, you're just going to hop over to the Fusion page and drag that right into your Nodes viewer. You'll get a little pop-up saying it was installed. And to close and reopen DaVinci Resolve, you can click OK. Then you would close and reopen. I'm not going to do that just because I'm showing this off. And also, um, I already have these all installed, so I don't believe it's actually doing too much for me. But that same DRFX file, um, as long as you're on 17.2, or later, you should have the uh, availability to just double click that. If not, you can always drag it into Resolve and it will get this pop-up. Do you want to install? If you want to install, you can just click install and then those will be added. And again, this should install three separate instances of Proto. In the Fusion page, you should be able to press Shift Space and type in Proto and you'll see Proto 2 Effect. And back on the edit page in Generators, Sterling Supply Company, you'll see Proto 2 here. I do now have two copies because of the first installation and the second installation. Um, I have a video about removing presets if you do this by accident. But I have Proto in here as a generator. And if I hop over to Effects, Sterling Supply Company, you have Proto 2 as an effect as well. Hopefully this gets Proto in a lot more of your hands. And if you want more information on the whole scope of what Proto can do, absolutely uh, check out the original release video.